Alright, y'all, let's talk Gina too. If you don't know by now, there was a connected woman in the industry known as Gina Two who recently exposed the fact that she contracted AIDS and given her rapid and sudden deterioration, she probably had it for about eight to 10 years, which is why a lot of people on social media are making a big deal over the fact that she has been linked to many uh, up and coming rappers, many uh, more famous black men and just men in general in the industry. And I'm not here to discuss the nature and the nitty gritty details. It's the fact that given her deterioration, she's probably been, she's probably had it for quite some time. So you start to think, wow, just how many other people got sick because she didn't know herself. And I look at this whole situation with Roe v. Wade and I'm like, y'all going hard in the paint for the right to continue sexual liberation without worrying about being boggled down with a child you don't want. And that's all well and good, but for God's sakes, where is the self-awareness? Where's the self-care? This is what scares me the most. I'm a black American man. And the women in my communities across America, black women I'm talking about, have high levels of HIV. It ain't because it's just DJ Pope. It's because of recklessness. They sleep with the same group of men. And don't tell me that's not the case. Demond George anybody That man has 33 kids By 20 women 20 women He impregnated 20 women For 33 children So imagine If He was patient zero For those 33 women Just imagine that example This is why I'm looking at this whole thing with Gina too. And I'm like, this could happen to anybody. And this is what's happening to black American females. And I believe I have a dog in a fight because these are the women in my neighborhood. These are the women I desire more than any other woman on the planet. I'm not going to even front. I've gone a long time without being in a good relationship. People think I'm hopeless. Like, well, you ain't going to find you the black type of black woman I want. See, that's the thing. And if it scares me so, because I don't want promiscuous women who don't take care of themselves. It's about look, you can get down, you can be the best of them, you can throw it back, clap them cheeks, but when you're doing it for the neighborhood and you're not throwing a shell on it, that's a problem. Do it for your man. So when he and you are no longer dating or married or whatever, it's going to be like that Wiz Khalifa song. He, you may make me remember you like you remember me. Make him remember you. Not like, yeah, that's her. This is what she does. Because this is all you're going to get. So we don't know how she got it. Before I ramble off too much, we don't know how Gina 2 got it. We don't know who got it. Do Nick got it? Chris, I at this point, who knows what's going on? Or how many others? Because I've seen the videos. She can't walk, y'all. Without a walker. 
she weighs about 50 to 60 pounds. But she still managed to cake up her face and come on social media. But I like that she's being transparent with the fact that she was careless. There's many other women out there who aren't doing that. Because it's never their fault. God knows they don't realize they're sleeping with dirty dick Tyrone. And then it just spreads. Because dirty dick Tyrone, if you got somebody like George, Demond George that can impregnate 20 women. Means he slept with even more than that. And let's say, like I said earlier in the video, if he was patient zero, for example, for an example, it's that quick. And everybody worry about the right to delete a fetus. And you're not even worried about safe sex. Tell me that shit ain't scary. Tell me it ain't scary. So, like I said, I don't know Gina from a can of paint. So this video isn't about breaking or destroying that woman. That woman's going through enough right now. This is a teachable moment because it can be anybody out there. Anybody. And I feel that the emphasis on Roe v. Wade shows that a lot of women are not even worried about contraception like I said that's some scary shit but I digress anyway y'all it's fury I'm here and now I'm out back to work for me peace